What's going on champs and champets? It's FireMonkey here and in today's YouTube video I have finally completed a very important challenge on the Battle Royale Island, right? As we all know the brand new rank system has officially released and with it came ranked quests But as you can see by my menu right here, I've done them all I have done all 50 ranked quests and I have finally received the Burn Bright emote. So in today's YouTube video, I will be telling you about my pathway, you know, my whole entire interesting, you know, a little bit of lore regarding this whole entire quest grind, what I think about it, and what happens after you do all 50 of your ranked quests. So firstly, you may notice that I am a gold 2 at 69% to the next rank. This is actually where I got ranked after I played both of my matches. In both Battle Royale and Zero Build, I ended up in gold 2. But despite being in gold 2, when I actually received this emote, I noticed something very weird or interesting about it. Once I do the emote right here, as you can see, it is a silverish color, right? Now, this isn't the silver rank because all of the ranks actually have a flame on the hand when you do it. What it actually is, is the un ranked color meaning that for some reason despite this emo being earnable already right despite all this stuff being out it is in a weird pathway where you're unable to actually do anything with it to showcase your current rank and instead you just have the normal emo right that anyone can do anyone with this emo regardless of if they're platinum unreal rank or anything they just have the default unranked glow now this is something that isn't supposed to be happening and is supposed to work normally and we've done some testing behind the scenes right we've tried going into a ranked match to see if the emo would have the special glow there it didn't have the glow there we tried making sure that both our battle royale rank and our zero build rank were the exact same it didn't affect the glow at all we tried going in creative and other places like save the world to see if maybe it's just a weird instance glitch or something with a lobby or something and no the glow just doesn't work at all and now to actually showcase what this emote's supposed to look like because i'm a leaker and all that stuff and with the help of someone named this niles over on twitter and on discord and everywhere else i have a video to showcase to you guys of all of the ranks for the actual emote sorted from lowest to highest so this is the unranked emote so this is the one that's currently happening to everyone who owns the emote right now but as we continue onwards we'll actually start Start seeing that when we get over here you can see how bronze actually has a flame and everything on the hand and you'll notice that theme the actual ranks have flames on the hand and they have a different color so that was bronze next up we're going to be seeing silver and this is how the emote is supposed to work and you can even tell how silver is different than the emote I was doing in the lobby so it appears that right now the actual emote is bugged unless they gave us a false description because when the blog post originally released and as of right now it states that it will show your current rank by the way this right here is gold and next up is going to be platinum I do believe but yeah it's supposed to show your current rank and for some reason it's just not doing that at all so what some people are speculating is maybe it shows your highest rank at the end of the season so once season zero ends it shows that rank next up after platinum I do believe we have diamond yes we do so you can see that right there you can see the nice little design they've got going on for it after diamond if I can pull it up real quickly because I don't remember the rank name but this is one of those single division ranks right this right here is the elite rank which is kind of like a inverted silver rank in a way right next up is champion which I think is pretty cool my favorite rank design is platinum just because it's got like a green glow to it but champions kind of got the double color theme going for it and then finally is unreal rank which you might think has a lot of extra flair or something but no it's just a simple design matching the color scheme of like a purplish and a blue in there you know there's some blue sparks or whatnot but that is the emote itself and how it's supposed to show up in all of the different ranks but of course as of right now it's currently broken but you may be asking Okay, you did that, right? You got the emote. You know, the emote might not be working for you or whatever, but you still got the emote. So what happens next, right? Well, it doesn't lock you out of doing challenges, and instead it gives you one repeatable challenge that you saw at the start of today's video. Complete 10 ranked urgent quests. So every 10 ranked urgent quests you do will grant you 15,000 XP. And this is repeatable, meaning you can do it over and over and over and over again until season zero is completely done for. So there's no reason to stop grinding ranked, right? If you're someone who wants to get super high in ranked, you want to get to the highest division, you know, all the way to Unreal rank, you have the option to keep playing, to keep doing those challenges, and everything and keep gaining XP as you go now people have done the math of course and it's around 1.5k XP per challenge you do assuming that you do all 10 
ranked urgent quest you know perfectly in every single match and everything so it's basically 1.5k xp per match but it's still bonus xp for you and it incentivizes people even more to play the ranked mode because at the end of the day you're getting a boost to your xp and everything for playing a mode that you enjoy while grinding out a mission you want and i think that honestly is a pretty nice idea now it's going to be interesting to see how when next season releases how they modify the xp values to see if they increase it decrease it or do something along those lines but I would love to hear in the comments down below, what do you think about Ranked? How do you feel about its release right now with the whole entire Zero build situation, you know, trios being removed, you know, Battle Royale having solos, duos, and squads, while Zero build only has duos, and do you hope they continue to expand this in the future, opening up, for example, Zero build solos? Because personally for me, I've honestly been doing a lot of no-fill for Zero build, right? And then if I want to make sure I at least don't get de-ranked, I'll go ahead and hide for most of the match so, you know, I know I'm at least safe to go out there and try fighting two people when I'm at a disadvantage of me just being by myself but sometimes i'll put on a fill you know play a little matches with random people and hope that we end up getting some good placements together but yeah with that said i'm glad to have the grind over i'm super excited just to have all the emotes and stuff because it's just nice to have it right you know it's nice to have the little banners you know the little like sprays and everything especially knowing that they're like a free reward for people to claim right now i feel it's just nice to know that those challenges are done for me i don't even have to worry about it for the entire entirety of the next season right because the season one for the actual rank mode doesn't even start until chapter 4 season 4 so I get a whole season just to kind of vibe you know play ranked whenever I want to play ranked for the focus of playing it as a mode to try getting a higher division instead of playing it as a focus of oh I want to get an emote reward or something like that but yeah with that said I have finally completed the ranked grind I got the emote and despite it not showing my actual rank I still think it's a pretty cool emote right you know I still think it's going to be nicer once it's actually you know fixed up and everything so people can show their rank properly but until next time I hope you champs and champions enjoyed today's little YouTube video Video where I unlocked the final rank reward and found out what happened next in Fortnite. Like the video if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't like it, and peace out.